1-800-NUTSHELL.COM or give us a call at 1-800-NUTSHELL and uh, you can talk to us about okay, that. Okay, my friends, we'll stay with us. Uh, by the way, I, I do have a breaking story announcement, um, but I'm not going to be official with this and I'm not even going to mention a name or anything, but I'm going to ask for your help. I am hearing a story that uh, somebody has passed on. I cannot confirm it. Uh, Tom and Lisa are working diligently to try to. I cannot say anything more about that. But those of you in the Coast audience who may be in on that story and know something about it, would you please e email me at george at coast to coast am com. That's all I know right now. That's all I can say. Because he would have been on that plane with with Clemente. All right, Charles. I'm at this point where I think I have enough information now to uh, to go with this story. So stand by, folks. Here we go. We're getting reports, uh, and we have been over the last thirty some minutes. That uh, Art Bell has died. Uh I'm trying to get my composure here, folks. Uh, he was 72 years old. Uh, our senior producer, Tom Danheiser, and executive producer, Lisa Lyon, and Jimmy Church have been working this story all night. Uh, I'm going to go to Tom in the L.A. studio. George, I'm right here. Um... It's a very sad night. Uh, I just got off the phone with George Knapp, and a press release was sent to all the media. It simply read, Community announcement, longtime resident and radio show host Art Bell died today at 72 years old in his home in Pahrump, Nevada. It's truly a sad night. <sighs> We've got such fond memories, and it's just something that's unbelievable, really. You know, Art and I were not that close. Uh, we had our differences. Uh, but he was uh, one of those instrumental in me being where I am right now. But I know, even with your differences, that you guys always kept the audience in mind, and you still do. And so that was a common thread that you guys had together. God, he just had his second little baby. Yeah. I know. Gosh. Uh a little bit later on in the program, we'll get Jimmy Church on. Uh, Jimmy's been working the phones, and uh, he's got some information. Apparently, the Nye County Sheriff's Department uh, has made the announcement. Uh, one of the problems, and the reason I did not go with this uh, 25 minutes ago, is because of the Internet. You just don't know. Uh, but uh, there's just too many other media in the Las Vegas area that are beginning to report this story now that uh, I, I think it's important enough to, to go with this. Uh, Art uh, it would have been uh, 73 years old in June. He was born on June 17th. Go ahead, Tom. Uh, I am waiting for a call back from the spokesperson of the Nye County Sheriff's Department. So Why are they so secretive about this? I don't know. I actually called three times in each person there are different people and they said we cannot confirm we cannot deny but we will send you over to our spokesperson and of course i got voicemail okay well folks we're, we were going to uh have friday the 13th open lines uh uh next hour uh i'm going to open up the lines and we'll just uh talk about the memory of art those of you who heard some things and we might get some clips or two that we might be able to play. Um, this is breaking very fast tonight. Uh, he has had problems with COPD, uh, his uh, chronic pulmonary uh, disease. Uh, he was a heavy smoker in his life, and um, he had some very difficult times breathing. He was hospitalized uh, about a year or so ago uh, because of this. And... Uh, I don't know if that has uh, played a factor in this or not. Uh, they are not reporting on the cause of death. Uh, but, uh, Charles, I want to bring you in. Did you know Art at all? Had you ever been on with him? Yes, uh, yes, I was, uh, George. And I know uh, he preceded you uh, on this program. 
Uh, he certainly, you know, I have good good thoughts, good memories of him, certainly. Uh, well, he's, he's why I'm here, kid. Well, that's never met him personally, but only heard good things about him, uh, for sure. So let's uh, let's carry on this hour, Charles, and then uh, I'll have some special open lines next hour as well. Uh, Jacob in Bristol, Tennessee. Tough act to follow here, Jacob, but go ahead. Hey, guys. I'm so sorry to hear about Art Bell. He was a great guy. I've actually talked to him a few times on the radio, and he will definitely be missed. Uh, that just it broke my heart. Uh, it really did. 